Hmm. Maybe I just really stepped it up a notch. Um, as far as the dueling game on here, I, I really like that one better than that time bomb in space. Hopefully we'll get to see it, of course. You did the right thing, DK, because you knew you didn't have any coins. Yeah, that's the thing about when you have the player set on hard difficulty. If they know they can't pass it because it's either nighttime or they have no coins, they know they, they can't pass it. Okay. Oh, only 29 at stake. Crazy cutters! Oh, ranking them in. Oh, raking them in is one game I... And standing in this position, I'm not really good at it. Yeah, I'm just not good at this game, period. Where, where DK is standing, that's what I'm most... That's what I'm used to the most. Maybe I might be able to get this set of three mushrooms. No? Well, maybe this set. Uh, I got the gold, but DK's got a commanding lead. Ooh. Just miss it, DK. <laughs> oh, I can overtake him right now. Come on. Yes. <laughs> wow. I don't think I've ever had a win like that. All because DK um, put out his rake out at the wrong time. I mean, he's supposed to be an expert at this kind of game. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Where's the next star at? Oh, right there. Um, I think I will use my mushroom right now just to prevent Luigi from getting there before me. Or at least get further than him. Eight. Fourteen. Oh, the worst thing is I have to go through two different bank spaces. That's really annoying. Well, at least I got ahead of him by three spaces. And the amount of coins I got, that's the same number as the, the system we're playing this on, the Nintendo 64. I just really hope a lot of Nintendo gamers don't miss the, uh, the good old days of the N64. It's just a fun system to play. Not the first one I ever played, though. No. I played the uh, the original Nintendo Entertainment System back then. It was all right. Lights out. This time I am running with the ball. I bet a lady doesn't know how to knock out the brothers. She knew how to knock out an ape because an ape doesn't know how to avoid a hammer. But at least, uh, but at least these two plumbers know how to do it. Almost there. I think we might. Wow. Peach sure was a, <laughs> a very good idiot right there. I must say. <laughs> She just doesn't know how... She knows how to get out an ape, but she doesn't know how to get rid of plumbers. And besides, those plumbers rescued her back in 1981. Seven. And he's probably gonna steal my coins. Yeah, I think he will. Of course. Well, I got no choice. 21. That's a lot. But at least I got more than double of Luigi right now. And then, didn't we just see Peach land on Bowser already? Yeah. Let's see chance time. Oh, she has to give coins to Bowser again. Oh, wait. Ten coins, Bowser, please! Well, that, that's just the rule of the game. When a player's got no coins, Bowser just 
gives him 10. I guess that's just how it has to go. Um, do I want to buy a gold mushroom right now? Nah, maybe not. Now I hope there's not a womp where the, uh, uh, the next star is. I think there is. Because, um, on the next turn, if it's, if it's still night, I still can't get to that star because Wolf is frozen. He can't move. If he buys another key. I'll bet he wants to go through that door again. And Peach is solo again for the second straight game. Crane game, of course. Uh, just hate Crane game. I hate it both ways. I will say that. But. After Luigi, if she goes for me or DK, then she will definitely, um, lose. Yes, she will definitely lose, because she won't have enough time to get any clock and drop it in the pipe in time. I know she won't. Let's see. Four, three, two, one. Come on. Yes! <laughs> what did I tell ya? That was, that was really close, but I knew that was the thing that would not let her win. Oh, wow. That's pretty much the best way to win when you're with the team of three. And I'm glad I recorded that right there. That rarely happens. It rarely happens. Wow. You probably only see that, like once a year. That's pretty much it. Well, at least that won't... doesn't look like it's blocking now. So I'll be able to get the next star anyway, that, which is good. Three... Four? That's not gonna get me to the star. And it's gonna make me land on a battle space instead. 20 per player? We got 67 coins at stake. Bone balloon cars, come on. Crazy cutters, oh yeah, I did wish for this one. I gotta have the most points, though. And cheap cheaps aren't that easy to cut. I'd have to say this game is easy to play when you're just a little kid and uh, you're just trying to trace around the picture. But as you get um, really smart with this game, it, um, it can feel like um, you feel a little delusional. Let's see. 90. Well, that's good enough to win, at least. I usually get in the 80s with the Cheap Cheap. I did get 100 points one time with the Cheap Cheap, but that was a long time ago. 46 points, I'll take that. I still gotta wait till the next turn to possibly get a star. Well, at least Luigi doesn't have enough. Yeah, him losing that battle minigame really helped. Is he gonna go through that door again? Man, what's he doing? He's really just going nowhere right now. He's pretty much continuing his stupidity from Spaceland. Cake factory, please. Oh, Sky Pilots. I better be the one steering the plane. Yes. And you always want to be the one steering the plane, not the one flapping the wings, because when you flap the wings, your teammate doesn't want to go through the rainbow rings. But the best way to do that is to just, um, not flap your wings too fast. And I really hate that job anyway. I just prefer the job of um, steering the plane, not flapping the wings. And yeah, that record up there, 50.7 for me. Let's see if we can beat that. Agreement's going at a really good pace. I 
wonder if we'll see this game's counterpart a little later on, which is um, Bobsled Run. And we couldn't quite beat the record. We were 0.13 seconds over. Oh well. Man, I'm almost to 100 coins again. Yeah, I'm definitely in the lead for both um, minigame and coin star, but definitely not the happy one. I haven't even landed on one yet. Okay. Three. That should do. Yeah, there's definitely not too much drama going on right now in this one. I mean, when I did my first recording of Space Land, there was just so much drama. Right there. I'll take that one. And I just realized I'm going to land on the item space, and we're going to play the easiest item game in the world. This is the easiest item in the game in the world. We want the gold mushroom. This is really easy. Right here. I could have just punched the grave, but I wanted to. Um, ground pound it. Maybe I could have tried to pound it into the ground. That didn't work. Obviously. And he's still stuck in there, Luigi. Jeez. Four player game. Deep Sea Salvage, please. Honeycomb Havoc. Oh, man. This is where you gotta have really good counting skills. I might give out some tips in this game. I'll tell you what I, what I will do when it's my turn. I can't believe I have to go last. Um, there's six left. I'd probably go with two and hope that at least one of these two or one of these three, pick two. Yeah, that'll work. And now we need... Yeah, we needed um, Peach to pick two, and that's... That's... I didn't really think... I didn't really think about that, but when I, when I, when I was going last, it just seemed like I don't know what to pick. And I'm gonna go with two here, because um, there's still a long ways to go before... It's, because I'll still have another turn. That's the other thing you want to consider. Um, you may want to go for one here, because um, you want DK to pick one or two, and now Peach should pick... Oh, shoot. I screwed it up. I really screwed it up. I deserve a whack in the face. I guess it has to do somewhat with um, when I'm going last, and the honeycomb appeared the first one, that is, appeared a lot sooner than I anticipated. But we'll make that up next time we see it. Oh well. I really screwed it up. I hope I don't make that same mistake again.